Everybody, it's Matt. I'm going to go ahead and review uh, Panda Antivirus 2009 Beta. I've never reviewed any beta product before, but um, a lot of people have asked me to review this product. So, um, what we have here, like always, is a highly infected uh, PC. It's, it's got over 100 pieces of malware, and um, you can visit my blog for latest uh, latest updates to these videos. Uh, the blog is remove-malware.com. Um, I also kind of go through how I how I review these videos on the blog as well. Um, whenever I review an antivirus or an anti-malware program, whatever you want to call it, it's only to see how well it removes stuff um, because that's what my job is. I basically go out to people's homes and clean up uh, a PC that has been really infected. Um, or is barely infected, it just depends. So I'm always looking for a tool that will get me in and out of the job um, and get me more clients as fast as I can, basically, and, and get the job done reliably. So uh, I'm going to go ahead. I haven't uh, taken a look at this yet, so let's go ahead and just launch the installer here. So I'll break this video up into a few parts. Um, I have to keep them under 10 minutes for YouTube. So. I have used Panda um, a lot in the past. It was one of the antiviruses I kind of started out with when I started my business um, just because it detected so much stuff. Um, I had to ditch Panda uh, because I, I was using it in a corporate environment for a few companies and their reporting. Uh, basically the program would crash, uh, the Panda antivirus would crash and the reporting was extremely basic and limited and I couldn't even really send uh, the Panda people detailed reports because they had no way to report any errors. So I had to stop using them and I moved on to Kaspersky at that point. I'm going to select a cu custom installation. I'm not going to scan memory during install, not yet. I don't need a firewall turned on. I'm already behind a hardware firewall so don't care about that. So uh, the, the end goal of this is to have a, a PC that's cleaned up as much as possible, runs as normal as possible, there is no way to ever know if you got rid of every single piece of malware. The only way to know that is just to basically reformat the box, and that's it. Because malware beca can become very custom and very specific in certain cases. I'm going to go ahead and kick on my network card just for a few seconds here just to grab some updates.
So it's still loading here. I think the installer is trying to quit. I can hear my hard drive kind of going crazy, so it's doing something. <clears throat> The help file opened up. I uh, don't need that right now. Well, I don't see anything yet. I don't know what it's doing. I guess I'm going to go ahead and try to launch it. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and just do an update here. The update menu is right up there at the top. Looks like a five megabyte update. And I'm gonna have to pause this video, well, stop this video. Um, and then part two will be configuring a Panda Antivirus Pro 2009 beta. to kill my network card as quickly as possible here. I don't want uh, a bunch of port scans going out over my internet connection. That sucks because they always shut me down. Well, twice now. I understand too. But reviews must be made. kill this network card and then let this file get reconstructed whatever that means I guess it's installing the updates or something like that and I'm gonna go ahead and stop the video um, and when we come back we'll be configuring Panda and then uh, after that we'll be scanning and removing and uh, you know all the typical stuff so be right back <laughs> 